Today we are going to learn how to use Symmetry tool in Autodesk Sketchbook. For Symmetry tool, first go to Tool panel, then select Symmetry tool. There are three types of Symmetry tool in Autodesk Sketchbook, Y axis, X axis, and Radial Symmetry. If you want to lock the symmetry, click on the lock button. And if you want to hide the symmetry, click on the I button. Now we are going to use Y axis symmetry. Usually, we use this tool to create the face of a character. Then select the inking pen. Let's draw a face using this tool, but first lock the symmetry. Now look how the Y axis symmetry works. It works pretty well. Now time for X axis symmetry. First select X axis symmetry tool and lock it. Usually, we use this tool to create shadow or mirror effect. And look how the x-axis symmetry works. You can find the shading tutorial in the i button. Now we are going to use Radial Symmetry. In this symmetry, we get sections like this. We can increase or decrease the sections by dragging this line. Usually, we use this tool to create a mural, flower, wheel etc. Now look how the radial axis symmetry works. If you draw in one section, then it will automatically draw in the rest of the sections. So, these are the uses of symmetry tool you have in Autodesk Sketchbook. Please subscribe my channel and also do like, comment and share. If you like this video, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you.